will taste the yummiest. Um, what are you doing, Natalie? Being a bunny. But shh, don't tell anyone that rabbits can talk. Of course that's what you're doing. Because you're a weirdo. Are you going to say something? I thought rabbits could talk. Only if they feel safe enough. Well, while you're over here crawling in the dirt, we're going to play some Foursquare. And by the way, you aren't invited. Don't bite, Natalie. Don't bite. Good bunnies, don't bite. Bye, weirdo. That girl needs some serious help. Hey, sweetie. How was your day at school? I don't want to hear it. Whoa, whoa, Natalie, take a beat. Remember what we do with our angry feelings? Flush them in the potty. Nope, we breathe through them, remember? Let's breathe together. In for four. Huh, breathing is for weirdos. Hey now, watch your words, young lady. Did something happen at school that you're upset about? What? No way, young lady. You need some serious help. Natalie McIntosh Noel. I just... I need some outside time, okay? Good call. Go cool off and come back when you're ready to treat your mother with respect. Say hello to the rabbits under the shed for me. Okay. Oh, and by the way, you aren't invited. Okay, kids. You heard your parents. You can play out here as long as you stick close to Harvey. Awesome. Thanks, Harvey. Finally, outside time. <laughs> Harvey will keep their eyes on the skies. Ah, at long last, alone time with my wonderful wife. Away from the children, Harvey the hawk, and that one gigantic child that lived with us for about an hour. I don't know, Bradley. They've only been gone two seconds and I'm already feeling worried. Oh, don't worry. When we can't see them, they don't exist. Ha ha. Right now, it's just you, me, and the gourmet dandelion casserole that I cooked up for just the occasion. Delicious. It's hard to eat when I'm worried about my kids becoming food. Listen, Harvey's a good bird, strong, fearsome, and a committed vegetarian. They'll have everything under control. I hope you're right. Hey, it's Natalie. Uh, Harvey? Hey, don't distract me, buddy. I'm trying to keep my eyes on the skies. Harvey, you know that Bella hopped away, right? What, well, what did I just... And she's gone. It's okay, Harv. Natalie will watch out for her. Gee, my first time babysitting and I already messed it up. I guess now it's just us guys. Boy party! Bunny bump. Are you trying to punch me, dude? No, bro. You bumped me back. Natalie taught me. It's something humans do. Boys rule, girls rule. Yeah. Wait. But Mom and Bella and Natalie are girls, and they don't drool. Uh, boys, l listen. Uh, Fine, but they're still not as cool as us. Uh, about all this, uh, this gender talk, I I've been meaning to... I don't know, man. I saw Bella do a backflip once, so... No way! She can't backflip! It's true! I'll believe it when I see it. Anyway, what were you gonna say, Harv? Uh, never mind. It, it, it's nothing. <laughs> Natalie! Bella? Natalie? Hey there, Natalie! Is everything okay? You seem so sad, so now I'm wondering how to make your day brighter. I don't know how, but I know somehow we'll find a way to turn your great big sad brown upside down. They think that I'm a weed.
weirdo Okay, who cares if they don't like me But I wonder how to know for sure that I am not a weirdo I've always known I don't fit in I shouldn't really care, so why am I so down? Hey there, Natalie So what? They think that Is I'm a weirdo to do with all my feelings. I don't know what to do with your feelings either, but I wish the bad ones would go away. Me too. But right now, it feels like they're settled in for good. I think I might be sad forever and ever. Hmm. We could try asking my mom and dad for help. They're pretty old, so I bet they have to know the secret to happiness by now. You're right. I could use some serious help. We should come up with a name for our awesome trio. How about the Big Buff Bros? Okay, that's it. Uh, there's really something I need to tell you, fellas. What is it? Oh, you can do this, Harvey. I suppose this is as good a time as any. So here goes. I'm not actually a boy. What? So you're a girl? Nice. Bunny bump. Uh, oh, no, I'm not that either. L lately, I've been doing a, a lot of thinking, and, well, I have realized I actually am non-binary. Oh, that's cool, too. Bunny bump! Oh, thanks, Blake. Can we go scouting for snakes now? Wait, wait, wait. Hold your hoppers. Can we back up a sec? I thought there were only two genders. Actually, that is a common misconception. Heck, I used to think it myself, too. That's the only thing I was ever taught. But, really... Identity's a lot more complicated than two boxes. In fact, everyone experiences gender a little differently. Uh, here, let me try to explain what it's like for me. Of boys and girls you might have heard, but that's not me, no, not this bird. The box I was put in just didn't fit right, so Harvey pondered day and night until they came across a word and suddenly their world unblurred. Non-binary, it all makes sense. I'm finally not on the fence. I know exactly who I am. My pronouns are they and them. How does that work, Harvey? Well, uh, it's pretty simple, really. You know how when you're talking about some people, you might say, uh, she's a vegetarian, and when you're talking about someone else, you might say, he's a vegetarian. Well, for Harvey, you'd say, they're a vegetarian. Oh, so like, look at Harvey, they're eating mouse poop. Precisely. Piece of cake. I know it might be new to you, it's quick to learn, I promise you, so come on, don't be shy, go ahead and give it a try. Harvey is my favorite hawk. With them, I really like to talk. And they are great at babysitting. Also really good at knitting. Yes, it's true, I like the hat they made for me. I'm happy that my head stays warm when it is cold. And I look great in hats, I'm told. Thanks for listening. Means a lot. My old family didn't do that too much. But, Harvey, I'm still, I don't know, a little confused. Uh, you know, it's normal to feel confused about something that's new to you. What matters is how you react to that feeling, and what you do with it next. Well, I don't know. What should I do next? My advice? In the face of what you don't understand, become a learner, not a bully. And don't worry, Brody. I'm sure they'll make you a hat, too, when it's your birthday. Ah, of course. Harvey doesn't pick favorites. Wait, don't we have the same birthday? Oh. Awkward. My compliments to the chef. The dandelion dish is delectable. Only the finest for my honey bunny boo-boo bear. 
Almost tasty enough to make me stop worrying about what's going on outside. Isn't it nice to have some alone time without interruptions? Mom, Dad, Natalie's having some emotional issues. Bella, thank goodness you're alive. Bella's right. I feel all stinky inside. Ew! So we came to ask, what's the secret to happiness? Uh... <clears throat> You've come to the right rabbit. I happen to be an expert on all aspects of the known universe. Oh, um, I don't know if that. To find the solution, first I must know. What's been troubling you? Basically, these meanies at recess saw me being a bunny and said I was weird. Pretty much they didn't want to play with me after that. Ah, well that's easy. It is? Next time you see those bullies, make yourself as large as you can. Thump your foot three times and scare them off by uttering the Falcon's war cry. Watch and learn. Are you sure that's going to help, Daddy? <laughs> You're such a weirdo, Bradley. That's right, he is. And we love him for that. Hmm. Interesting. Weirdo? I think the word you're looking for is apex predator. Mom, what would your advice for Natalie be? I wish I to make you feel unworthy, just remember, it's okay to be you, you, it's okay to be you, you're the one and only Natalie, and you belong here too, you're the one and only Natalie, and Well, at least it's a decent backup plan if plan A doesn't work out. <gasps> Harvey, look! Well, well, well. If it isn't the grass-eating freak who flew the coop. Oh, oh, hey there, Harold. Long time no see. And Holly, if you're really grown since I, uh... Grass eater. Grass eater. I'm growing up to be a bird of prey like my daddy. What is that you're hiding, brother? An afternoon snack? Hi, my name's Blake, and this is Brody. I take it you finally learned how to eat like a normal hawk. Or do we need to show you an example? Example, example! Harold, Holly, don't even think about touching them. Oh, well, if you're not planning to eat them, we can't let good food go to waste, can we? Yeah, can we? It doesn't have to be this way, you know. The food chain can be broken. Did you hear that? Harvey's even brainwashed the bunnies with his unnatural agenda. What's next? Should we be nice to mice? <laughs> good one, kiddo! Actually, yeah, being kind to everyone is a good thing. Don't listen to his lies, child. This mixed-up nonsense is inappropriate and damaging for impressionable young predators. You know, Holly, our parents aren't always right. Yes, they are. Right, Dad? Right! Now. Let's remind our prey about their place and our power! 
Don't take another step. I will not let you hurt my new family. Family? Family? He really thinks. You mean they? 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 <laughs> Wait until the hawks at home hear about this. Hey, is that a bully I hear over there? Natalie, be careful. It's dangerous. You hang with a human too? Oh, this keeps getting weirder. What's wrong with weird? Every family looks different. What matters is that we all accept each other. Even a weirdo like Harvey? I'm a weirdo too, and I'm proud. Me too. Me three. Um, me four. Me and these rabbits under the shed have one rule. With us, there's room for everyone. But if you can't follow that rule, then there's no room for you. I guess we'll have to make room by gobbling some of you up. It's gobbling time. Shoo! Shoo! Bad birds! Bad birds! Shoo! Get out of here! Shoo! Shoo! What is all the ruckus? Is everyone safe? We are now, thanks to Natalie. It was pretty easy. I, I'm so, so sorry. It, it's my fault they came here. I, I, I understand if you, if you never let me babysit the bunnies again. What are you talking about? You're the coolest babysitter ever. Yeah, it's not your fault that Harold came to bully you. It's his. Besides, you protected us. So you're not firing me and evicting me from under the shed? Of course not. Mom! Dad! Harvey told us today that they're non-binary. Is that true? Why wouldn't it be true? Son, I may be an expert on all aspects of the known universe, but the only expert on Harvey is Harvey. I hope you didn't question who they are. I raised you to be a respectful rabbit, remember? You're right. I'm a better bunny than that. <sighs> Thanks, kiddo. Thanks, everyone. It feels real good to have a home where Harvey can be Harvey. It's like Natalie said, what matters is that we accept each other. I think I owe somebody an apology too. Bye, Bella. Bye, Natalie. Bye, Bye Natalie. everyone. Bye. And thanks for helping me feel less stinky. Hey, Mama. Hey there, Natalie. How was your outside time? Pretty normal. How was your inside time? Thanks for asking. Busy, but pretty normal. So, anyway, do you think I could sit on your lap for a sec? About earlier, when I came home from school... Yes? Well, I... I think I was being a bully. To you. I got bullied, and I let it turn me into one. I'm sorry. Thank you for apologizing. We need to find better ways to deal with your bad feelings than taking them out on me, okay? Love you, kiddo. Now, about these bullies. Want to talk about what happened at school? Thanks, but I already talked to the rabbits under the shed, and I feel way better now. Oh, really? And what did they say? They said I belong in the world just how I am, and if the meanies don't like it, then that's on them. Smart rabbits. Yep. The bully say, you must obey. Show them all a better way to make the world a safe place to play. In this one life, there's no time to doubt that we deserve to let our true selves out. No more worry that we can't be long the way we are. With compassion as my compass, I'll know what's right to do. When there's something I don't know, that's my chance to learn and grow. Being kind is not too hard and we can.